Hey guys, what is going on? It's Dota and you. So, as probably most of you already knew, I went to Jagex last week because they invited me along with four other players um, who are Lee Recital, who makes YouTube videos, Nathan from RuneZone, which is a fan website with an awesome radio, um, Jake, the number two ranked player, and uh, Ryan from the RuneVikia editor. And yeah, we got invited to, to go to Jagex and meet the staff, do some awesome things. Also designing a part of a mini game and give them feedback about the game in general and a lot of other stuff. So they flew me over on Wednesday last week and I arrived there at 1 p.m. The flight was like one hour, but like getting to the airport and all was like about four hours. So that took a bit of a while, but I was the first one in the hotel as well around 1 p.m. so then I decided to do some stuff with one of my clanmates who is Joke as you can see on the picture and we went together for some dinner and she showed me Cambridge around it was really cool because Cambridge really is an awesome looking city like all like old-fashioned with castles and really old buildings which is really awesome to see so then um, the day ended pretty quick uh, I met the other guys so I met Lee then I met Nathan as well and then the next day was the first day to go to the HQ. So we went together to the HQ with a cab and there where we met Mod J, Mod Crow, who arranged the whole thing. So we had lunch or a breakfast first and then they showed us the HQ. So what each department does and then Steve W talked about uh, play support and PMods. Then we saw a bit of the design team, the development team. So it was really awesome. And also got a quick chat with Mod Grizel and he was doing some awesome cool stuff with Virago, which you guys will see in a few weeks I believe. So that's gonna be awesome. Then we also had a talk with Mod Osborne about the Lords, or he talked mostly, we listened and asked a few questions and it was really amazing. I was never really myself into lore a lot but recently I started getting into it and what he has planned for in the future is really truly amazing and it's gonna be a lot of fun seeing the lores come more in the game. So then we did also a podcast with Mod Phoenix and the other guys and it was really fun as well. And as you can see on the picture, um, that's Jake on the left, that's me, that's Lee Redicidal, that's Nathan and that's Ryan from Rewiki. So we did a podcast and you can see that or hear the podcast as well on Podbean so I'll put a link in the description. Uh, it was like 35 minutes podcast which was really a lot of fun. And then uh, we got actually to ride the Jagex tank. Uh, MMG uh, first drove us to a parking lot of the old headquarters. And he actually let us drive it then on the parking lot. So I've got a bit of footage of that. So I'll show the footage right now.
then later that evening we had dinner with MMG and some of the other GA mods that I've known for you, such as Mod Slayer, Mod Reach and Mod Grizel. So having dinner with those guys was really awesome and then the next day, which is the second day at the Jagex HQ, which is our last day as well sadly, we got first to do the um, Lava Flow minigame again to like uh, go through it again. So we got our own JMod test accounts and that was really fun like I had the Rotten Potato and you could use the developer console like for doing everything, spawning Nexus, uh, wearing Tova out of nothing, Tectonic even. So that was really fun and we were messing around a little bit more than we actually were playing through the Lava Flow minigame. So then later that day we actually got to help design a part of the minigame with some awesome rewards. So that should be a lot of fun when it comes out and uh, I hope you guys will enjoy that reward as well. So what we did then is also talked about some RuneFest plans. So I'm gonna go to RuneFest for sure. So if anybody's gonna go as well, I'll be there for sure. And then we got to talk with ModMark as well about um, why he did EUC and why Squeal Fortune and all that other, uh, th all those other things are useful for the game, as they could have made RuneScape 3 out of it. Otherwise, yeah, we wouldn't have RuneScape 3 right now with the awesome music and the graphics. So what he said was truly like amazing, and like I really understand his point of views about everything. A lot of people give him slack for like being m mostly featured on videos, but he's a really cool guy, and people really should like stop talking so much shit about him. So yeah, then we had dinner again, but this time it was with the big guy, so it was with MMG again, with Mod Pips, who's the executive producer, and with Mod Mark as well. So they also asked us for like ideas about the game and like what we think about this and that, and it was really amazing to like talk with them uh, face to face, and like they actually listened to us as well. So they got some awesome things planned for the future, which I sadly cannot say because I'm on NDA. That means that I'm not uh, able to say anything about future content, but you'll see that anyways. So that was really awesome and that was the last day at the HQ as well. Then the next day it was like our day off and we could do anything we want. But we decided to go to Cam to stay in Cambridge again but go into town and do some awesome stuff. So we went with a few who were still at the hotel and I met up with my clan mates again. And yeah, we went uh, in the city, we had subway and then we did actually some ponting or went out ponting so that's basically sailing so I've got also a bit of footage here before I drop my phone yeah vlog that's my vlog <laughs> Hi. <laughs> so scared to drop my phone. Yeah, you won't be getting it back if you lose. <laughs> yeah, you don't. Oh. <laughs> don't even pretend. I know, yeah, because if you lose it, you're done. So yeah, that was a lot of fun. Ponting is actually quite relaxing as well. Like as. You were just sitting in those small boats and like just going through Cambridge, which was really beautiful as well. So we had a lot of fun doing that. So that basically was then the last day. Um, later that day, we also had dinner together at a Chinese or no a noodle restaurant, I believe it was. So yeah, that was also really delicious as well. And then the next day, we had to leave sadly. So my plane left at 3 p.m. I believe, and I arrived. In Netherlands around 11 p.m. so that was quite the day but I really enjoyed it and it was an amazing experience like all together and I really am grateful for Jagex what they did because this was really fun and actually like meeting the J mods behind like the game was really awesome so yeah guys I hope you guys enjoyed it as well and I'll see you guys at RuneFest if anybody's gonna go I'm gonna go for sure so that should be amazing as well and if you guys want to watch a bit more footage, uh, Lee managed to do a bit of vlogging and I featured in uh, his vlogs a little bit. So if you want to hear some funny jokes, you should go to his video. I'll link it in the description as well. So yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this kind of vlog as well, like me talking about not really RuneScape related stuff. So yeah, guys, um, I hope you guys enjoyed it as well and I'll see you guys next time.